हेलो यात्रीज सो वेलकम बैक टू अवर यात्री क्लाउड ऑन एजियोर सीरीज सो यर इन द लास्ट वीडियो यू डिप्लॉइड यूर सेटिंग एप्लीकेशन यूजिंग एज योर एज यू कैन सी द लिंक विच इज एक्सेबल बाय अवर पब्लिक यू आर एल ऑन अवर माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एज योर डोमेन एज योर स्टेटिक एफ डॉट नेट वॉट इफ यू कैन एक्सेस द सेम वेबसाइट यूजिंग योर ओन कस्टम डोमेन जस्ट लाइक यथा चौहान डॉट मी so here in my case dot me is my own custom domain which represent my portfolio so if you have your own domain dot com which is represent the commercial dot in for india and there are lot of domains which you can see right which you can see dot io dot ai which is running now too much famous correct so yeah if i know this time is not you to buy your own domain which is monthly and yearly based subscription but see if you don't know how to connect if you don't know what is the dns then it might be difficult for you to get into cloud devops networking role okay i know it's not right time to purchase and test it out to just learning purpose at least watch this video and also in next upcoming videos i'm going to share with you the free domain but till now you need to just understand how we are going to connect custom domain so before going further you need to understand what is the dns so dns is nothing but domain name system so as you can see uh i don't want to type each and every times ip address right to access my website as you know every website is running on their own ip address which is unique correct so now in this domain name system what we are going to do actually first we are going to redirect our ip into our custom domain to easily remind in our mind that's it okay so just like that first one you can see the dns now next as you can see without the dns we need to remember the numbers instead of names clear now next time is that in the dns you can see the lot of different different types a records cnm records mx records txt records which is most famous right and mx records and as for this is for specific on email security okay cnm for the www dot subdomain okay so now what is a subdomain so as you can see ecc dot godary dot com so here in this case godary dot com is the domain and dcc dot this is your subdomain which is running the your website okay so now hope you got the difference now next one what is the cnm records right the canonical name record which is represented your nickname right so this kind of you can see so simply let me showcase it to you what exactly that means so when you are going to here and type blog dot yatri cloud dot com right so here you can see blog dot is my subdomain and you can access my different website correct now what if you can type yatricloud.com okay so this is your own domain okay this is particular domain which you can see hope you got the difference right so now here i am going to share with you how you are going to connect any static web application okay or maybe any app service you are using that you can connect with your own custom domain so yeah let's get start so first i hope you know how to deploy the application using static web app services and then what you need to do you need to just go into your search bar type custom domain hit enter and uh, let me check once okay uh sometimes it's not working maybe internet issue so yeah here you can see the custom domains just click here and just wait for the loading and here after the loading you can see this is automatic configured right which is accessible by our website this one so yeah what we are going to do we are going to add a domain so now here you can see we have a three options first custom domain which you can buy from the azure dns so that we are not going to do the custom domain on other dns so that we are going to configure just because of my domain is purchased from the godaddy maybe from your net uh, maybe from your name chief or maybe from hostinger whatever you can select a second one and let's say you don't have a domain and you want to create one okay then you need to just select the third option but as of now everyone mostly using the second option as you have a domain on third party so click on the custom domain on other dns 
and here you need to enter the domain which you want to configure so in my case what i'm going to type so static web app dot cloud.com so i want to redirect my this website into static web app dot cloud.com so this is the subdomain okay and this is your own domain yathricloud.com you can directly type yathricloud.com if i want to connect this same website on my this url clear so as of now you can type as per your requirement and just click on the next and here you can see hostname record type which is automatically showcased from azure this is a c name if you are type yathricloud.com here or any particular domain which you purchase then you need to select txt records clear in my case i'm configured the serve domain then click on the c name now as you can see i want to just copy these values and paste into my godaddy so senior this is and here is the host name host name is nothing but your subdomain that's it and here is your value so let's copy this value go to your godaddy and here i'm going to select c name type uh, let me first give the password okay here you need to just type your subdomain static web app and just hit the your value clear i just cross check it once static web app find and you can see the ttl which is at least timing which you can see half hour save okay now after that all you need to just click on the add now it's gonna be add on and you can see the validation field just because we added just now so you need to at least give a bit time yeah so now you can see it's already written now now we are able to access our website on our custom domain so I'll just copy the domain name and go to the new tab and paste it here hit enter so now you can see my website is running on my own custom domain as you can see HTTPS, this is secure and static web app dot .com. Now, if you are running your website on virtual machine or be somewhere using app service, right? We are going to cover in the next upcoming videos. So now, I hope you got to understand how we are going to connect with custom domain. And let me know if you have any feedback. And yeah, see you soon in the next video. Join the Azure Yatri community and check it out the description about the DNS, which is given in the description. So see you soon. Bye-bye and take care.